go to exiftool.org, download the application, use your video with exiftool, add the rotation flag and you're done. Hey there, I am Greeny for Greenbox. If this video helps you, let me know in the comment section down below. And in this video, I am going to show you how to change the video orientation without having to run the video through video editing software. As a demonstration, I have this video I recorded on my iPhone of an aquarium I went to and unfortunately the video aspect ratio is in portrait instead of landscape and we are going to change this and all we need to do for that is to go to exiftool.org, download the latest version of the exif tool. This tool allows us to change the EXIF data of media. Think of EXIF data as instructional data for your video player or software using your media, how to handle your media. And one of those flags which we can set in the EXIF data is the orientation flag and that's what we are going to change. Once you have downloaded the EXIF tool, make sure to unpack the application. You can place it anywhere on your computer. I am placing it here next to my video file. Once you have extracted the EXIF tool, we need to change its name. So it's only reading EXIF tool. Once we have done that, we need to open a command prompt. And the easiest way to do this is to press the Windows key and R on your keyboard, then type CMD enter and this brings up the command line and what we now need to do is we need to drag and drop first the exif tool into this new window then hit space go back to your folder drag and drop your video hit space again and then at the end add minus rotation equals zero degrees and if we hit enter the tool is now creating a new video file with the correct orientation. And if we open this file now, we see that it is now in the correct orientation and we have fixed the orientation issue. As a bonus, I want to tell you some extra tricks with the EXIF tool. So what we have done here, we used the minus rotation zero option on our video. And this just tells the video to be in the orientation of zero degree which means the video before was rotated by 90 degrees. If you want to change, for example, a landscape video into a portrait video, so the other way around, you would change this equals zero to an equals 90. And I can demonstrate this by rotating back the original video. So let's do this. Let's delete the original video and do the same one more time. So we take the EXIF tool, press spacebar, then take the video, press spacebar again and say minus rotation equals 90. And if we hit enter, we now will rotate the video back into portrait mode. As a last tip, I want to show you how to tell EXIF tool to not create an original file. So let's delete the original file again and let's rotate back our video a final time. To do this, we are again using the equals rotation zero option, but this time we are also adding a second option, which will be minus overwrite original. If we hit enter now, the tool will again flip our video, but this time not create an original file. And that's it. That's how easy it is to change the orientation of video files without having them to run through video editing software. If this video helped you, let me know in the comment section down below, maybe even with a super thanks. I am Greeny, this is Greenbox, and I will see you in another quick tip. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.